Secretary, uh, Minister, I just want to establish your government's opinion on the critique of the uh, Spivak Tribunal that was presented to you by uh, the retired detective uh, Chief Superintendent John O'Brien, uh, former Chief Superintendent Michael Finnegan, and former Chief Superintendent Michael Staunton. It's a 30-page review and critique, uh, and they contest the, the uh, findings of uh, Judge Spivak. What's the government's opinion? Have you had a chance to look at that and your view on that? Come on. Well, well, of course, the government has to accept the report of Judge Smithick. Um, uh, I, I presume the deputy is, is raising that particular matter uh, in the uh, presentation in this soil, uh, seeking very, uh, either to defend on guard the Shihona one day and to uh, criticise them the next day. Uh, it's difficult, difficult to keep pace with what is the deputy's approach to Angar the Shikona. Uh, I, I, I'm more interested in, in knowing whether Sinn Féin uh, uh, condemns, whether Sinn Féin condemns, whether Sinn Féin condemns the barbaric murder of the two members of the PSNI, and in the context of the deputy's presentation, uh, uh, a very cynical presentation of this house in this house as a defender of Angar the Shikona, he might indicate whether. He was supportive. He might indicate whether he was supportive. It might. I'll deal with that. I'll deal with that. The deputy might indicate to the House, in expressing his support from Garda Shikona, whether he condemns colleagues, whether he condemns his colleagues in Sinn Féin who met those who were being released from prison for, uh, and who were convicted of matters relating to the death of Detective Sergeant, uh, Detective Sergeant Jerry McKay. Yes. Any journalist or any independent person out there to observe the transcript of today's questions and answer session from all the deputies here and to see did we get a straight answer to any of our questions. Here we are now, you spoke for nearly one and a half minutes and you still have not answered the question put to you as you haven't in relation to the Commission's investigation and you've got into spurious diversions using your old uh, skills as a solicitor to not answer the question that's been put to you. So that's my point of order. Well, you. Could you Deputy, answer a yeah. question that has been put to you for one in this House or in one of these committees. Deputy, can I, can I just deal with that? Uh, there is a provision in standing order that any deputy can go to, to uh, the can call uh, if they're not happy with the reply, and I'd, I'd advise you to do that, yeah. Now, the next question is in the name of Deputy Dennis Nocton. Sorry, sorry, okay. Is there an answer from the Minister? Well, he I've, said, the I've said that. Yeah. Uh, deputy, De deputy Dennis Nocton has question number 7. 7 and 33 are grouped.